Okay, Septile, bullet seed attack, let's go! Septile! Alright, now, Septile, leaf blade! Septile! Awesome! Ash, Ash! Whoa, Septile, hold on a sec. Here comes Officer Jenny. Septile! Hi, Officer Jenny. I'm just practicing some moves with Septile. That's great, Ash, but look at the park grounds. Whoa! Oh, I, I, uh... I didn't realize the grass was getting so messed up. It's okay. It happens all the time with grass-type Pokemon. That's why there are volunteer gardeners that keep the park looking pretty. They have a shed here with supplies to maintain the park grounds. In fact, they're here working on the grounds today. Could you help them out by patching up the grass when you're done? Okay, cool. Great. I'll show you. Here are some shovels, the wheelbarrow, and the rake. And over here are all the fresh grass patches that the volunteer gardeners are using today. Feel free to use what you need. They'll be happy to have the help. You can count on me. The field will be good as new. Thanks. Septile. We had a good practice, but now it's time to clean up after ourselves. Septile. There are a bunch of different sized squares. I sure don't want to waste them. I better call Ada. Hiya, Ada. Hey, Ash. How's it going? It's going... well, patchy. I've been practicing in the park with Septile, and we accidentally tore up some of the grass. I'm gonna fix it with the supplies here, I just don't know how. Okay, so you just have to figure out how much grass you'll need to cover those spots. Exactly. Well, first you imagine the spots you need to cover in the ground are inside a rectangle, because that's the shape of the grass patches. Okay, with you so far. And then you find the space inside that rectangle. The space it fills is called the area. And if you know the area, that will tell you how much grass is needed to cover that spot. Oh, okay, I get it. But I don't know how to find the area of a rectangle. Then I'll talk you through it. But first, tell me what you know about rectangles. Well, I know a rectangle is a shape with four sides. And the opposite sides of a rectangle are the same length. That's right. So, to find the area, you've got to measure the sides of the rectangle. Start by measuring the base. Okay, I've got this tape measure here. But where's the base? It's the line on the bottom of the rectangle. But actually, either pair of parallel sides in a rectangle can be chosen as the base. Really? That's cool. So then, I guess the base is three feet long. And that means... The line that's opposite the base is the same length? You got it. Now measure the height of the rectangle. The height is the shortest distance between the rectangle's bases. The height is a side going up. Here? Look at you go! It's two feet. So the opposite side also has to be two feet long? Right again! Pikachu! Now we need to find the area of that rectangle. And then we'll know how much grass to use. Exactly. There's a formula for finding the area of a rectangle or square. It is area equals base times height. Huh. Okay, so if we know the base of the rectangle is 3 feet and the height is 2 feet, the area must be 3 times 2? You know it. And 3 times 2 is 6. So the area is 6? Almost. Actually, it's 6 square feet. Okay, feet makes sense because that's what we measured. But why square? I thought this was a rectangle. <laughs> it is. But when we're finding the area, we're multiplying two sides by two sides. So to get the number that depth, the answer is always in square units, which is written with a little two after the feet, like this. Ah, so for multiplying feet, the area will always be in square feet. Yes. And if you're multiplying inches, the area will be in square inches. Or for a really big space? You could even have square miles. Wow! But then what's the area of an actual square? A square has all four sides of equal length. You're right. So its base times height would be the same. And you can just say area equals side squared. Whoa! This square and square stuff is sweet. Totally. Now, are you ready for some rectangle practice? Septile! Figure out the size of each one of these rectangles. Okay, Ada, but I'm going to need your help, too. You ready to give these squares and rectangles some space? Yeah! We have to figure out the size of each one of these rectangles. 
You may need a calculator or scratch paper for this activity. Let's start with this one. What is the base length shown here? Great! Now can you tell me the height? Awesome! Now we're ready to figure out the area of this rectangle. Can you tell me what the area is? You got it! Okay, let's try another one. This one looks like a square since all of the sides are the same length. What's the area? Yeah! How about this rectangle? Let's find the area of this one. All right! Here's another rectangle. What is the area of this one? You got it! Okay, let's try another one. What is the area? All right! We're getting close. Here's another rectangle. What is the area of this one? Yeah! Here is the last rectangle. What is the area of this one? Awesome! Awesome! Thanks for all your help. You too, Ada. No problemo. Looks like you're good to go. And now, Ash, I gotta go. Bye! All right, let's get to fix it. We got the supplies and now we know how to use them. So it's time to watch the grass grow. Well, grow back at least. But I'm gonna need your help again. You tell me which patch of grass would cover each spot in the field? Let's see. The area of this spot is 20 square inches. Which rectangle patch of grass would cover it exactly? Click on it. Awesome! Okay, the area of this spot is 27 square inches. Which patch of grass should I use? All right! Okay, the area of this spot is 25 square inches. Which patch of grass should I use? Yeah! Okay, the area of this spot is 35 square inches. Which patch of grass should I use? You got it! Okay, the area of this spot is 12 square inches. Which patch of grass should I use? All right! Wahoo! We did it! Good as new, just like Officer Jenny asked. Pikachu, maybe we should get in a couple of practice moves of yours before we go. Are you up for it? Pikachu! Yeah, nice one! Satire! Pika! Don't worry. Now I know how to patch things up. Pika! The base is...